In this video, we will demonstrate how our plugin works by creating a simple jump counter. First of all, make sure that the plugin is enabled before we begin. And since we started with an empty project, let's add the third person template to the project. With the template imported, I will open the template's level since I intend to use its game mode. Now we will create a simple widget blueprint to display the jump counter. Since this is a straightforward setup, I took the liberty to speed up this part of the video. With our widget ready, we will create a new asset for our plugin called Event Watcher. Let's name it Event underscore on player jump. Now I'll open the character blueprint. Then I'll call the event on jumped and broadcast it to our previously created event watcher asset using our custom node called broadcast event watcher. Next, we'll open the event graph of our widget and call our node named event watcher. You should select the event to be listened to in the details tab here on the side. By the way, don't forget to promote the text block as a variable, as we'll use it here to create our jump counter. Since this is a simple function that will only increment a value x to our text, I took the liberty to speed up this part of the video as well. When you're done, don't forget to activate the event system in the event graphs where it will receive the events. Additionally, you can open the event watcher for debugging and check which objects are broadcasting or receiving events. There's also an option to add a struct as a payload, but that's for another demonstration. With that, everything is ready and your jump counter is now functioning. You can get the plugin on the Unreal Marketplace. For more demonstrations and tutorials on its usage, you can join our Discord, read the documentation, or follow our channel here on YouTube. The link for each of these items will be in the video description.